What's exciting about the, about the area of entrepreneurship is its growth in terms of uh, interest and scope uh, in today's society. You would have heard of things like the gig economy. The gig economy is all about the fact that you will take on tasks and projects and be the master, if you like, of your own financial destiny. So entrepreneurship is an exciting field in that area. It gives you the opportunity to build your own capabilities and take control of your destiny in, uh, in, in the sense of your employability or your employment, your career. That's exciting. Well, on this fifth edition, we actually take a very hard look at the advances in learning and teaching and entrepreneurship. There are two main elements. First is the design-led thinking, and the second one is the lean entrepreneurship approach. Design-led thinking is important for an entrepreneur to really get into the hearts and minds and the shoes of the customer, understanding what they use the product for or service for, how they use it, how they engage with it, to really design the product to suit the customer. The lean entrepreneurship approach acknowledges that often entrepreneurs are tight on time and money and it looks at approaches to rapidly uh, develop the business concept as a, as a whole and uh, acknowledges that it takes uh, lots of ideas to come through and this is a fast way of moving through those ideas to determine a most feasible business model. The way we approach this book is to develop uh, a career model for students. Other resources can tend to focus on the almost superhuman uh, approaches of individual entrepreneurs. You know the names. But we take an approach that is uh, designed for students to grow into entrepreneurship and we recognise and acknowledge the fact that there are many pathways through it and many destinations to arrive at with entrepreneurship. Within this book you will find more than what is just between the covers. We believe that uh, learning entrepreneurship is by the individual and for the individual. So subsequently or consequently we actually have a number of resources that will take you outside of the resources of the book and complement and help you build your own responses to the questions that you need at the time you need them. There'll be links to uh, external agencies and organisations that can help you in the current problems of today. There'll be articles on uh, how to deal, for instance, with stress in, in the inside uh, while you're developing your venture. There'll be other resources which give you good practice examples, uh, cases to learn from, and resources that will help you build your own uh, capability and your own journey in entrepreneurship.